mad at this bitch. Coming at you, pre-recorded, done a motherfucker. So, turn! Uh, <laughs> this is like the stupidest little purchase that I've made in a while. Uh, but, what the hell am I wallet doing over here? <clears throat> but, uh, so I was, I was browsing through uh, YouTube last night. And uh, I seen one of them little, like, mini clips, like the shorts. And uh, some dude was, like, cutting open some, uh, like, like a mini can of Spam, like a little mini can of, like, I don't know, t uh, toilet paper or some shit. And I was like, what the hell? That's awesome. It was, like, a can of Spam, like, this big. And he's trying to cut it open. And it was literally, I think, a can. I don't know. Maybe not. But he said he couldn't cut it open. So I seen the shit. It said mini brands. So I'm like, man, I got to see what this is all about. I want a little tiny can of Spam. That's kind of cool, I guess, right? Not really. But <laughs> so it, it took me into this whole new world, apparently, about, uh, I mean, a whole new world of mini collectible bullshits. And I happen to see them on Amazon. They're cheap enough. Like, I got season one through four or some shit like that. Um, let me just open this shit. You know what? Hold on. I need a motherfucking drink because, man, I had uh Uh, quite the weekend, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you about it in a second here. Shout out to Arctic. Arctic. <clears throat> this shit. This shit keeps me, holds me down. ArcticOutdoors.com. It holds me down while I'm on the hustle and grind at work all day. Uh, I'm an alcoholic and apparently a caffeine addict, so I'm always perpetually dehydrated. And so I need one gallon of water minimum a day otherwise you know i cramp up and i lose my shit <clears throat> so anyway these are um mini brands that's what they're called and it's this little like i don't know japanese look i won the fucking puerto rican lottery ain't that a bitch and i can't cash it in uh they're like these little japanese or chinese uh shits and they come in these like little plastic balls paws Man, it's like the dumbest shit. The gayest shit, too, by the way. This is so gay. There's like little children, girl, little girls uh, type of stuff. Collectibles. Like, But it's like Pokemon, I guess. Like, you don't know which one you're going to get, you know. Or like trading cards back in the day, if you remember that. Um, so, but you see, like, it's got like a little ranch dressing. It's got like a baby bell. Like, so it's it's fake. It's the dumbest shit in the world, but, uh, you know, I was drinking a little bit last night, and I'm like, you know what, it's like 15 bucks, like, you know, each one was like, I think I'm, uh, season four is on the way or some shit, uh, I don't know which series two, uh, it's probably series one, I don't know, and then probably series three or whatever, series three, right, so, for each series, I guess they have like 70, you know, little different shits. Anyways, let's just open this shit up, man. You'll see what I'm talking about. But basically, these come, each series has two balls, pause, to open up. And inside each plastic ball, um, you've got five different slots. And inside of each mystery slot, it's random. Uh, you can get, you know doubles of the same shit you've gotten or whatever i don't know whatever so it's just it's like pokemon i guess i, I never collected pokemon but uh baseball cards you know like you might get nolan ryan or somebody you know what i mean or basketball cards you know which i think i have a michael jordan card somewhere in my basement uh like all sealed up and everything so it, i guess it's like the thrill of the hunt kind of thing here with this shit so Let's just open one up and uh, so you see he's got like a little zipper or Beanie Babies. Remember those back in the day? I never collected them, but I, I remember people. I never collected Pokemon, but I remember people being all. Oh, this is Series 2. What the fuck? Man, let me open Series 1 first. <clears throat> so let me tell you about my weekend. Oh, and the homeboy Hell Yeah is on his way here. Shout out to the homeboy Hell Yeah. Um, he's trying to eat some pizzas. We may or may not eat pizzas because uh, I, I had a bunch of cast iron burrito shell pizzas. So what you do is you take a 10 inch burrito shell, you put it in your 10 inch cast iron pan, you spray some oil down or you coat it in oil, whatever. And then you put your little toppings, you put a lid on it and then you just like let it bake, I guess, for, I don't know, five minutes or whatever. And if it's not to your liking, you hit it with a torch. 
I usually use the torch for my steaks, but uh, you know, crisp up the, 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 the pepperonis and all that good shit. So I'm kind of pizza out, you know, if you know what I'm saying? But uh, but I kind of never get actually pizza out. So I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what happens. I'm supposed to go to Jet's Pizza, which is a, uh, not a Chicago style pizza. What the fuck do they seal this with? It's a uh, Detroit style pizza, which when I was actually in Detroit, uh, it was really fucking good and I've been hooked ever since. Alright, so that's that. Oh, and also my, my conundrum for the week now. So mini shopping brands that fit in your hand. So you see this ball and then you just peel where the little zipper is. I guess you gotta unzip it or whatever. No, it's not zipped. So I feel like I'm destroying this whole packaging by doing this shit or whatever. I guess that's what it's meant to do. So my, my, my current uh, drama, I guess, for the week is uh, I decided on Friday, I'm like, why don't, why don't I just ruin my entire weekend this weekend and replace my water pump on my old ass 27 year old car? Why, why, you know, that just sounds like something amazing to do right now. And so I, I started that. I got the water pump for real cheap. It was 70 bucks. All right, so check this out. I don't know. I think there's like a little dial here. It looks like you, I don't know if you turn it or rip it or, okay. Oh, oh, oh boy. So now, this is such a, like a little kid's, uh, put away your childish something. I don't know, the Bible says something about that. All right, so you just open it right here. It looks like a little tab. So we're gonna crack these holes open and see what, what the fuck is going on. The Chupa Chups. That's hilarious. And it's got like a little foam, you can tell. All right, let's just see what these offer. Uh, so anyways, so I figured, yeah, let me ruin my weekend by trying to install my water pump. And I did, and I got the water pump for real cheap. It was only 70 bucks, bruh. Uh, Warheads Super Sour. <laughs> it's just so gay. All right. Um, so I'm like, you know, pretty confident because when I called the mechanics, one mechanic told me, uh, we'll do it for 400 And I was like, that's a lot. Considering I can get the pump for uh, 70 bucks, you know? And then I called a different mechanic, which is a little bit more reputable, I would say. Them niggas wanted $650. I was like, what? So needless to say, what the fuck is going on in here? I don't understand what this one is here. This is a bunch of stuff here with instructions and all that. All right. Someone's commenting on my video. It do be like that. Shout out to Aton Miranda. I see you, my nigga. Uh, I, shout out to the homeboy, uh, Jose Rodriguez. I was, yeah, Jose Rodriguez. For commenting lately. Bro, you're killing me. I'm coming over for the food. I, I think I re replied to them. I did reply to them. What the hell? All right, so, so I'm like, I'm not going to spend 650 fucking dollars to replace my goddamn water pump. You know, who the fuck do I look like? Donald Trump in this bitch? What the hell is this? A Kiko man. <laughs> this is awesome. A soy sauce. I kind of want some sushi right now. So it might be up for pizza or sushi. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. If this nigga wants sushi or if he's down for sushi, it's right next to the micro center we're supposed to be going to. So damn, look at that. That's awesome. <laughs> Dinty more. Beef stew. Like... <sighs> This is the gayest shit ever, man. But it's it's just like, like, I don't know, man. It's like, I'm, I'm a child. I'm literally a child. You know what I'm saying? So that's one Pokeball, right? Christ. All right. Uh, so yeah, so I put my water pump in. Well, I mean, it's thinking of reminiscing about this. I put my water pump in. Where's ball number two? Everything's going good. Um, you know, I drained all the fluids, took me a few, anyway, I mean, it took me a little while, you know, because I was like making sure I'm doing everything perfect and all that. Perfect. <clears throat> and, uh, so I go ahead and do that. And then I get the, uh, gaskets, you know, the paper gaskets. And I'm like, okay, I need, uh, gasket sealant because that's what the thing called for. <clears throat> this thing said, you need the fucking gaskets sealant. So, so I now have to buy a gasket sealant. I had to scrape the gaskets off the block. All this other shit. 
the, the, the bitch part was draining the fluids because I didn't jack my car up and I don't have like a drain system. So I just kind of like, uh, uh, I had like a little rubbing, 32 ounce rubbing alcohol thing that like one of the pipes shoots. You can see it here. Probably. No, maybe not. Well, anyways, one of the pipes shoots like at a 45 degree angle coolant. So I had to like angle it to catch all the fucking coolant. And the bucket didn't fit that I had. And then fucking what else? Then as you disconnect each hose, like now a different type of vacuum. And you know what I'm saying? Like it was just, it was a fucking nightmare. So it took me a while to drain all that bullshit. Are these supposed to come off? And then, uh, so I got all that. I drained all the shit. Like I said, I replaced the other one. Man, that's pretty fucking awesome. Look at that. Moon pie. <laughs> this is the dumbest. Uh, all right. I'm just gonna keep opening while I tell my little story of the weekend. Uh, so these come with like a little checklist, which I just want the ones, ah, that's pretty awesome. The Mentos, that's kind of cool. So I, uh, where was I here? So I replaced all the shit, everything's good. I get the new water pump in, I got the gaskets. Oh, the gasket sealant, Smarties, candy rolls. The new gasket, or, you know, it, it, it calls for a gasket sealant, so apparently that, you need to uh, let it cure for, like, fucking 24 hours, so I had to revisit it the next day, which was yesterday, Sunday. Damn, I got a matching set of Kiko, man. It's a sign, man. I should get some sushi today. All right, this is done. All right, so <clears throat> so I do that. Uh, I replace the shit. I, I, got, I got the new gaskets with the sealant on. That's badass. I actually bought some of this over the weekend. Real bacon pieces. I made some, uh, that pizza that I was talking about, the cast iron burrito pizza. I put real bacon bits in the sauce because that's how I roll, nigga. Like, what the hell? All right, is that all of them? No, yeah, that's all of them. All right, so season one, we're done. And, all right, whatever. Let's keep, let's keep going, season two. So, the longest, stupidest story of all time. Give me like 20 minutes. The homeboy, hell yeah, should be here in about eight minutes, so we got time. So anyways, uh, I go to replace the shit. It's replaced. I wait the 24 hours for the gasket sealant to cure on top of the real gaskets or whatever. Uh, and then the next day, so Sunday, I go to fucking... Uh, Oh, I go to screw in the coolant temperature sensor, which goes inside of the water pump with a 19 millimeter socket, right? And I had to buy a new one because the one from the old water pump didn't want to come out at all. And it fucking broke, the electric connector broke and everything. So I just bought a new one, it was only 20 bucks. So now I'm in 90 bucks, right? 70, 80, 90. No, about 110 with all the gaskets and all this, I mean, with all the sealant and all that other shit, Kool-Aid jammers. No, no, that's gonna stay there forever. Um, so I'm like, all right, cool. And then, you know, cool the coolant. I had to buy the coolant. Oh man, Javalia coffee, huh? That's pretty dope. <laughs> all right. I'm totally gonna. Nah, I'm gonna keep them. I was gonna say, I was gonna throw them out, but I doubt it. Look at this. This is the dumbest shit. Oscar Mayer wheat. I wish it was Vienna beef sausage. That would have been awesome if they had a Vienna beef sausage because you know shot tone so anyways uh where was i with this story this is a terrible story by the way what the hell is this damn nigga lunchables look at that that's i ain't even got a wrap and it's still fat all right so um and then the checklist for part two or whatever oh i didn't even tell you guys what the hell this thing is i don't even know what this is yeah it's some type of shopping cart that i gotta build i ain't building that right now and yes, I somehow got drunk off it too. How did I get so drunk so quick? <clears throat> this fell. So, uh, I go to Blue Diamond Roasted Almonds, huh? Yeah, look at that. That's awesome. This is dumb as shit, but I'm, I'm so entertained by this. I don't know. This is like, uh, yeah, that's done. Uh, where was I here? So I... Put the water pump in. I, I screw in the new coolant temperature sensor that I broke off the other one because it was, it's got a 19 millimeter socket. However, the socket head like makes contact with the fucking water pump itself, like the metal. 
So now, great, this is never gonna come out of here. Why would this happen to me right now? It fell literally perfectly in this hole, and my fingers are too fat <laughs> to grab the shit. What are the odds? Uh, and the cup holder stuck for some reason. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm gonna grab it by oh, there, by the by the by the paper. Huh? Ingenious. All right, so. So the 19 millimeter socket is touching the fucking, <laughs> this, is, this is a retarded story. It's touching the shit, uh, the, the water pump housing. So I can't really get the socket on properly. I can only grip like maybe an eighth of an inch of it. So I was finally, after breaking the electric connector on the original one, I, I was able to actually extract it from the water pump so I could go turn in the core or whatever. However, I still had to buy the new one, which was 20 bucks, like I said. So when I went to install it, I was expecting a similar type of problem, which when I was ratcheting in, I was kind of like a little bit forceful and I stripped the motherfucking threads on the water pump. The threads that accept the coolant temperature sensor, it, it was like at an angle. So I'm looking at it, I'm like, ah, oh, man. So I take it out, I fucking, uh, what the hell is this? The laughing cow spreads. It's legs, no? All right. What the hell? Oh. So, uh, and then the list. So, I take it out. I didn't see any, like, threads missing or anything like that, but, uh, <laughs> stove top chicken. Pollo, bok, bok. Um, you know I'm fat. I'm collecting little versions of actual food. So, uh, so I'm like, it can't be stripped that bad or whatever. Look at that. I actually use these French's crisp onions. These are really good, matter of fact. Um, so I take it out, I reposition it again. I use Teflon tape and I'm like, all right, hopefully, you know, nothing happened, whatever. So the next day I go to fill it with coolant. What the fuck is this, man? This is another, like, I gotta build this type of shit. I'm not doing that. This stays right there. And the Kool-Aid jammers. Right there. Look you at know, all this crap. So, so I put it in normally, pause, and uh, no, not pause on that one. I let it sit for overnight, you know, because I still had to let the gaskets uh, do their thing or whatever. Baker's dipping chocolate, I never heard of that. That's something new for to me. Uh, so I do that, all right, these are all done. What am I on? Series three now? So I go ahead and do that shit. I don't have a fucking knife, do I? I don't even have nails. I'm gonna use this uh, charging port again, like I did that one time. Seemed like it worked. In the Here comes hell yeah. Yep, that's him. I'm just gonna let him in. Enter! Enter! Jesus. This lock is only gonna be unlocked for like 30 seconds, so he better hurry to fuck up. 18 seconds. Be done with this real quick. I'll just open the fucking door because I'm thinking. Hold on, bring your head real quick. Making a video. Yeah, I just got to my friend's house. Let me, let me uh, give you a call back later. All right, come here. Making a stupid video right now about gay shit. <laughs> it's a gay thing. And I'm drinking, so. It's like, oh man. Yeah, it's probably ready, ready, ready. How long are you gonna be? It's like two seconds here. I, I gotta finish my story about my water pump. So anyways. <laughs> I forget where I'm at now. So I go to fill the fucking shit with coolant, pissing everywhere. And I'm like, fuck. Uh, the next day, Saturday, Sunday, whatever it was. So I go to fucking, uh, you're probably going to hear about this later, eventually. So I go to fucking do that. Shit's leaking everywhere. I extract the um, coolant temperature sensor. And I let the 
coolant piss all over right back into the same container I just poured it out of. And uh, that's where I'm at with that. Uh, so basically, uh, I don't know if I have to tap this, the hole that the, the coolant temperature sensor goes into. I'm looking for y'all's advice. If, you know, whoever is watching this and happens to be a mechanic. Hell yeah, no? No. This is the gayest shit. Have you ever seen these? Little things. It's oh like the, I know, it's the dumbest shit. But I wanted the spam, the can of spam. That's the only reason I bought all this shit. So look at it. And it's like Pokemon. Bunch of oranges. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, so yeah, so I don't know if I have to tap into the fucking, uh, what do you call it? The aluminum housing for the fucking cooling temperature sensor to go into. I don't know if that's gonna fuck something up. Super small, I'm gonna, more heads. I'm fucking retarded. I want my spam. It's, it's not, I didn't get it though. Good luck. No, no, it's too late now. Heath bar. What the? All right, uh, so, so yeah. I figure if I tap the shit, it's going to leave shavings everywhere. However, if I grease up the tap, uh, you know, maybe I can contain the shavings to the threads itself, themselves. But I have to have the right tap. I don't know if I broke the threads uh, to the point where more Kool-Aid jammers? What the hell? If I broke enough threads to where it's still going to leak regardless, uh, I got Teflon tape. Damn, high and yellow mustard. Hell. I mean, I use Plockman's myself, but whatever. You, know. <laughs> you walked into the wrong part of this video. Yeah, these are all. I got one more. One more ball to open. You see all this shit? I know. Whatever, nigga. <laughs> I wanted my spam can. I didn't even fucking. What a mess. So, yeah, so I don't know if I can do that or if I gotta buy a whole new water pump. Ain't that a bitch? Look at the perfect, the perfect nigga to show up. Mini me uh, with some mini kick on mine. I'm thinking it might be a sushi night, nigga, not a pizza night. <laughs> That's the dumbest shit. See, I spent so much money on the dumbest bullshit. But it's, you know. What's up, man? Take it to the grave with me? How'd I get this belligerently drunk so quick? <sighs> anyway. Like, I literally just got home. How the fuck you open this shit? So that's my saga. Uh, if you know anything about uh, tapping out a water pump, coolant, fucking thread, whole thing, let me know. Uh, like I said, I got Teflon tape. I got gasket maker. I don't think any of those are going to hold under, I don't know, 15 pounds of pressure or whatever, PSI, square inch. But we'll see what happens, I guess. So let me know in the comments or whoever. We got a couple more here. Hot tamales. Show this off for me, please. Hot tamales. Look at that. I ain't even got a wrap and it's still fat. Vanilla jello? Is that a thing? Let's make, let's expedite this. Another fucking yellow mustard. Ain't that a bitch? No spam. I didn't get the, the, the one thing I bought this for, <laughs> which was to get the spam. Another Mentos. I think I have a different flavor of Mentos. Yeah, this is, I got different Mentoses. Mentai. Is that how you pluralize it? Why don't they have a mini Alvin Williams? How about that? That would be awesome. That would be dope. A fucking little Velveeta cheese. That's pretty dope. Look at this fucking disaster down here. You can't even see it, but it's a mess. Sweating. I got one shot left in me, and I'm out of here. All right, well, that was a miserable waste of time. Thank you for watching. 24 minutes. Shout out to Rectech. I'm drunk. You don't want sushi? It's up to you, Chief. Because we got the Kiko now. Box, box set now. Maybe they won't put so much rice in it this time. No, they will. They're Japanese, Chinese, Mexicans. All right, I gotta go, my niggas. Uh, thank you for watching. I've been out.